What's poppin' people? Welcome to the hottest NFT and crypto channel coming at you straight from the self-proclaimed king, Nikki G. Kidding guys, I know nothing, but again, thank you for tuning in. As you guys can tell, I am absolutely not a financial advisor. Nothing I say in these videos should be taken as financial advice. Please always do your own research if you decide to get into the space. Let's get right into it. All right, guys, today's tip of the day is if your phone gets water damage, put it in rice. That's it. Let's get right into it. If it's only for a moment, those stars, I really wanna hold it. So tight, my hands begin to mold it. Watch me fall. All right, guys, welcome to another video. I just wanna start out this video by thanking Jess, the founder of Bounty Sports who's here with me to talk about the Bounty Sports NFT project. You know, they're one of the first daily fantasy sports pick'em style operators in North America. Super, super impressive team. It's a real company, very public. We're gonna talk a little bit about them today. Jess, thanks for coming on. Hey, thanks so much for having me, Nick. Really appreciate it. All right, so my first question for you, Jess, is who is Bounty Sports? You wanna give me some background? Yeah, great question. So Bounty Sports is the first paid pick'em fantasy operator in North America. Basically, traditional fantasy sports, players or users pick players and players player outcomes. But with Bounty, all you're doing is picking winning teams. The more teams you get right, the more money you win. And you're playing against other fans, average fans, real fans. We're currently in 24 states and in Canada and applying for licenses in 13 additional states plus several countries. We look at ourselves as trying to democratize fantasy sports. We're trying to bring fantasy sports to the average fan or fans that are new to the sport. It's a community driven model. And I think most of all, we try to create a simple, easy and fun game that people could understand. You don't need to be an expert or a pro in order to be successful at Bounty. That's awesome honestly i think that's very thorough very clear explanation of it so that's awesome thanks for that bringing me to the second question all right jess so what makes this project unique give me a little bit more information on this for sure so first of all we're the first gaming company to release an nft i mean there's obviously lots of nft companies that have incorporated sports and gambling and gaming but we're the first gaming true company to release the nft we're also completely doxxed but i think what sets us apart the most is we the founders are not making a single dollar off this everything that we're we're doing every dollar that we make is going right back into the hands of our community and the holders of the nft so basically the money is going towards first of all obviously project costs but second of all we have packed this project with utility this is a utility based project any individual holder of this nft can win over a hundred thousand dollars trips all across north america and beyond to different sporting events we've packed it with utility so we're pumping a lot of the funds back into the hands of the holders of the nft and if we make any money over and above that it's going to be put towards licensing and basically funding our expansion across North America and to new country. So basically in one way or another, we're putting the money back into the community. We, the founders, we have investors, we get paid a salary. There's no upside to this project other than continuing to grow foundation of the community, the engagement in the community. And I think that really sets us apart from other projects that I think can be seen as largely profit driven for the founders. Yeah. That's the one thing that stands out to me the most is that like, it's, you guys are real, you're established, you're already out there in the real world. And what you're doing is you're bridging the gap from web two to every kind of joke about it because the name of our company is bridging three but like exactly what we're doing is we're bridging grid the web two company to the web three company really the fact that you guys are going all in all back to the community and then only thing that you guys are putting into the company is that actually to expand that community and what they're capable of doing so i think to me it's like the most unique selling proposition in the nft space the real company hands down the coolest project i'm a big sports gambler or daily fantasy sports user so for me it's kind of a no-brainer and i love it and i already use the app so i think it's awesome well it's funny you say that nick so a lot of the concepts within the nft were actually part of our corporate plan anyways build a subscription-based model have multiplier points give our community trips and experiences and so we actually in collaboration with you decided that the nft is a way for people to have a subscription to bounty sports because we know there's a lot of sports enthusiasts a lot of um, sports gaming enthusiasts whether it be gambling fantasy sports in the nft community and we thought we could bridge that gap roadmap so uh, the nft allows hold that asset as an asset as opposed to a one-time purchase and be able to increase its value over time so it's kind of a two-pronged approach on the one hand, I think that it allows us to bridge the gap between the NFT space where we know a lot of our community is. And on the other, it also allows us to take a lot of these concepts that we've envisioned and actually put them in a one neat, tidy package that really creates real value for the holder. Awesome. Thanks for that, Jess. Thank you. As I'm hovering over your guys' white paper right now, essentially going through it, showing the people on the screen what's actually going on. Do you want to describe a little bit more about the utility of the Bounty Sports, the league? 
NFT? Yeah, for sure. So first and foremost, what everyone needs to understand is there's only going to be 3,333 league members in Bounty Sports. Our community has over 13,000 users in it, and we're only four months old. By the end of the calendar year, we project to have between 50 to 80,000 users on our platform. So right now you're going to be through, there's going to be 3,000 of 13,000 members, but in a few short months, it's going to be 3,000 of 50, 60, 70, 80,000 members. So as we continue to expand through marketing, through access to new states, people are going to join the platform and they're going to see a $2,500 contest a month, $10,000 contest a month. They're going to ask themselves, how do I get in that? And the only way for them to get in it is to hold an NFT. And so there's going to be an inherent demand from all the users that we're bringing in through our natural marketing efforts that is really going to provide its kind of core intrinsic value to the holding in itself. Now, when we think about utility, there's three core contests that users can join. So there's going to be $2,500 a week in contests on the Bounty Sports platform, NFT holders can join. And by the way, it's exclusive to only NFT holders. The general public can't join this and NFT holders can, it's free to play, $2,500 a week. We're also going to be doing the same thing for a monthly contest for 10,000 and we're going to have a year end contest for 25,000. Between these three, any individual holder can win over $100,000. In addition to that, we're also going to be giving away or having a contest for one NFT a week. So we'll be giving away 52 NFTs, a winner take all contest uh, once a week as well. We'll also be doing monthly raffles to pick holders of the NFTs to go on experiences and trips, packages to sporting events all around North America, but also beyond. So this applies to global holders as well. If you're in the UK, it might be a Mid-City versus Man U game. If you're in Australia, it might be an Aussie rules game. We'll work with the winners to find an event, all expenses paid trip, flight, stay, tickets to sporting events. There's also a cash multiplier. So as users spend more on the platform, they can actually earn a multiplier up to two times the amount. This multiplier will apply to that weekly contest, that $2,500 weekly. So let's say for instance, you buy it at the floor, there's no multiplier, you play on the platform and you have 1.5 times multiplier. If you were to win say $600 in that weekly contest, it would be 1.5 times that you win an extra $300 equaling 900. So it's a way for users to buy the NFT and actually increase its value. They have control over the value of the holding simply by playing in our regular contest. Tier threes and above are gonna have a monthly balance. We're gonna add funds right to your account every single month. And we're also going to have have what we call the final showdown. We're going to pick three holders randomly to compete in a winner take all contest. The winner of that contest, them and a friend will be going on an all expenses paid trip to the Super Bowl. Like I said earlier, packed it with utility, both for global holders and also holders in available regions alike. Wow, I mean, like you just smashed it. As a sports gaming user, that takes all the boxes for me. Any platform that I play on can't offer stuff like that. And when they do, it's it's offered to the experts, to the people who like, you know, basically do this as their job, not for an average user. So I think that that's like the biggest point to get across like all these benefits i think that the, the utility with this nft is just unmatched for people who are interested in a certain niche market like this this is the perfect project like i'm extremely bullish i'm extremely excited for this project just absolutely knocked that out of the park you know if you guys have any questions join the community ask the questions the community member the team members are available all the time they're always open to chats these guys do amas once to twice a week just to give as much information to the people as they can so guys join in the discord just awesome awesome explanation of the utility there. Thanks, Nick. And one final comment, the reason why we're able to pack this in is it's not like if we give a dollar uh, to the community, it comes out of, out of our pocket. Everything we make goes right back into that community. And that's why it's unmatched because this is not a profit-driven product. This is an investment that we wanna make into the community to simply grow the community, grow the number of users that we have on the platform and grow the engagement. And I think that allows us to uniquely position this, whereas other projects, they have profit in mind. And again, I think that's really what sets us apart. Absolutely. You know what, Jess, I just wanted to extend a final super big thank you for taking time out of your obviously busy day. You're a founder of a company, you're a founder of an NFT project, you're obviously extremely busy. And I wanted to thank you for coming on and explaining this amazing project to the people in my community and hopefully beyond. Hopefully everybody else can take a look at this and really see the value that you guys are bringing. Yeah, for sure, Nick. Well, thanks for having us on. And we're excited to be working with partners like you, like Bridge3, Pegsy, of course, who's doing the development for us. I mean, it really, it's, it's the great partners that we have that make this possible. So thank you to you, Nick. Really appreciate it. Okay, guys, that was direct from one of the founders of the company Jess. Now let's take a deeper dive into the project. So first things first, we are going to cover exactly what the project is, what they are trying to achieve. What is Bounty? As you guys heard from Jess, Bounty is essentially the first daily pick'em fantasy sports style platform operator in North America. And now they're integrating NFTs. It's a huge step for the game. And I really think that it's going to be a very positive one for the NFT space. Seeing more companies get involved in NFTs is super exciting and it can only bring good things because they can execute properly and they have a lot more on the line other than just having 
having an anonymous profile online. Having shareholders to impress, especially when they're banking on your success for your projects to increase the value of your company. Having to pay members in your company is also a big cost and it doesn't come cheap. So, you know, project success for companies is a lot bigger than it is for a random NFT project. It's not like a DGEN play where you're just putting out art and hoping it sells. There's a lot more on the line for these guys and I'm extremely bullish and, you know, here's why. First things first, I'm just going to go through the website and the white paper, team members, a little bit about the community and then hopefully have a demo of the app on my phone and then a little bit more about the mint details and then overall why I'm bullish on the project. So first things first, Bounty Sports NFT release. This needs to be updated because today they came out with an announcement saying they're cutting the supply from 8,888 to 3,333. So this actually makes me way more bullish on this project because they're delivering the exact same roadmap, the exact same prizes and everything is the same except that they cut their supply by more than 50%. That means if you're a holder in this pass, let's say that even if they have 3,333 holders, if you're a holder in this pass, your odds significantly increase when every single month you can win a sports package experience. I'm going to go through that in the next section, as you can see, exclusive benefits, but cutting a supply by over 50%, ensuring success with the project and that the community is tight. To me, that just shows that they're obviously very competent and they know that the current market of the NFTs are down and that they really want to deliver a successful project to all those people involved. That really gets me excited. Only to continue on here, guys, six distinct tiers. Each tier up comes more rare than the previous one and will receive additional benefits with ownership. All NFTs across all of the tiers will enjoy league benefits summarized below, fully detailed in the white paper, which I will link below as well. We went through all of this with Jess, so I'm not going to beat a dead horse. Essentially, guys, how to play. So right now I'm on my phone recording a video. Essentially, these are all the contests that they have. When the NFT comes out, you're going to have on your profile, you guys will see my name, don't care. On your profile, you'll have NFT verification where you can verify with MetaMask and then it'll show that you are an NFT holder, which will allow you to join NFT only contests and whatnot. So if I can just show you, there's a multi-sport contest, $4 entry, prizes and structures right there. And then essentially you have to make picks. So who do I think is going to win? Let's go here, Toronto Maple Leafs, of course. Uh, we'll go the Sharks. We'll go with the Flames here just because USC, I don't know what sport that is. USC Trojan, UCLA. I don't know much about basketball. So we'll kind of just tap through the basketball. Portland State, Oreo Masvidal is going to win that fight. And I think that guy's going to win. So now I picked my winners. My potential points are at the bottom of the screen. Your points, 16.63. So if I pick all the winners, I'll get 16.63 points and it'll put me up against everybody else who's in the contest. So you can't see anybody else's picks because that would be cheating. Uh, you can just copy off other people who win. Yeah, it's super simple, guys. They have different types of sports. You know, they're bringing more sports in. I know that they're going to be making those announcements on Twitter and in the Discord. Yeah, it's pretty simple overall. You can see live contests. You can see your past contests, how you guys did in them. Here's one that I won, Super Bowl selections. You can see I came in fourth place. I won $15. I had 14.4 points, but the person in first had 20.38. You can see, obviously, they made better picks than me and they got more points for it. So they picked the LA Rams. That was five points. Super simple app, guys. I hear they have some UI updates coming out with the website, with the app on the mobile application, everything. So like I said, super simple to play, super simple to use. And that's how you use the app. All right, guys, continuing down the page, they have the meet the team section. Jess is the founder and the CEO, Mark, founder and CMO, Ben the marketing manager, Liam, the operations associate, and they've partnered up with both Bridge3, myself. Yes, I am a part of the project. Yes, I am covering the project. Am I still bullish? Yes. Doesn't change my perspective. I want them to succeed. I want companies to succeed in the space. If you guys know the vision for Bridge3, you know why I'm doing this. Another partner, Pegsy Tech. You guys don't know, Pegsy was the original innovators of the ERC 721A contract. It posted it open source well before Azuki or anybody else used it. It was actually called ERC 721P for Pegsy, but they didn't care to take credit. They just wanted to see the space do better. So yes, Exitech Tech is an extremely accomplished and reputable development company, and they will be handling all of the Web3 blockchain development for this project. Super exciting stuff. The team is full of all stars. You guys can find their LinkedIn profiles. It's pretty easy. You know their names. You can find the company on LinkedIn. You can find it on Google. Their information is out there. They're doxxed, which is why I love when companies join the NFT space because fully public, they have a lot more on the line than a random person trying to sell Kevin's for you know 70. Super bullish on the team, guys. They are open to talk with anybody at any time. They hold AMAs all the time. It doesn't get better than that for a team. Honestly, this part of the website is more if you're really interested and you really want to read through it, you guys can go through it. I'm not going to cover it. It's going to be a really long reading. Take a look at the website, guys. The link will be in the description below. I'm not going to go too much into the white paper, but I am going to link it below so you guys can take a look through it. Just know that there's a vast amount of information in here. A little of the numbers are off because the supply cut. So just keep that in mind. But overall, there's a lot of information for you guys to learn about project overall, where they're putting the funds, the community, integrity being part of their movement, a little bit of what's on the website. Here's a complete summary of the entire white paper. And then, you know, 
know their plans to accept crypto in the future as soon as they can implement that not going to cover too much but white paper will be linked in the description below talk about a little bit about their drop i'm going to go to the discord essentially discord is starting out still pretty early air minting sometime in mid to late march not announced yet i'm not at liberty to tell you guys i'm not at liberty to tell you the mint price but just know that it's very reasonable and it is coming up in march there's still lots of time to get in there and get whitelist you guys can see on the side people that are in the server other people the first round pick is the og role and then the whitelisted role is called drafted to keep it in check with their sports kind of theme in terms of the overall drop it will be 3333 nfts the mint price i would just say it's not going to be crazy like all of these other mints that are going on the total supply is low you can expect the mint price to be reasonable the mint date is sometime mid to late march and that covers it really for the mint details strategy going into this one guys for me i am a sports gamer i love daily fantasy sports i'm gonna mint it so i can take advantage of all the utilities i'll probably grab a couple because then i'll get more extra raffle spots in the raffle i don't see this as a huge flip i see this as a longer term hold so you can actually use the utility of the project and like if you're one of the people that wins one of these monthly contests or weekly contests or the year-end contest a substantial prize it's a lot of fun like the company's paying for it right so you get to go on a super sick trip without having to pay for it without having to take crypto out of your crypto account and pay the taxes on it you get to go on the trip expensed by their company it's super sick like i said longer term hold for me i'm gonna pick up more that's just because i love the project i'm a part of it i want to support it and honestly like jess mentioned earlier their growth rate is expected like 80 90 users and 3333 nfts that many people that are all interested in sports gaming that can only say one thing there's gonna be a lot of buying pressure in the future as this thing grows so buying an nft is kind of like buying a share in their company and hoping that it goes up in value and their usership increases they have a full marketing team on their actual company handling the actual marketing of the app every day they get more users i think they're around 15,000 users now just probably mentioned it earlier but yeah that's my strategy guys this is not a flip for me it's free sports gaming for a year essentially that's the way that i look at it and yeah it's a long-term hold for me if you guys get in and want to flip it there's going to probably be enough buying pressure for you to do so in my opinion 3,333 nfts is quite a low supply you got to think around a 50 percent unique ownership you're looking around 1,500 people there's more than that in the discord already and they're all people who want to be in sports gaming and this project works for them so like i said still really early you guys can still get in get a whitelist spot get an og spot all the information will be linked below full disclaimer i am working with the project it is not hidden i am on the discord as an advisor bridge three is working with them directly and i am with bridge three there's no hiding from it guys full disclaimer i'm working with them but irrelevant information for all the details that i provided in today's video thank you all for watching the video today i'm super excited as i'm pretty sure by the time we put this video out i will be releasing my nft alpha pass for my group super exciting who knows how the launch is going to go best of luck to everybody involved i just know that i'm not going to stop building i'm not going to stop continuing to provide value for all of you guys no matter how i have to do it again thank you guys all for coming on this journey and we'll see you in the next video remember to drop a like comment subscribe hit the bell icon to stay up to date with my latest videos nikki out